Hey guys, we got a trailer here for Shazam. Let's check this out. Really excited to see this. You've run from movie foster goes. homes in six counties. Okay. I can take care of myself. When you're 18, give these people a chance. Because that's what they're giving you. Yes. This is Billy Batson. Make sure you make him feel at home. They seem nice, but don't buy it. It gets real Game of Thrones around here. Dude, just messing around. You look at me and you're like, why so dark? You're a disabled foster kid, you've got it all. If you could have one superpower, what would you pick? Oh, Everybody Batman. chooses flight. You know why? So they can fly away from this conversation. No, because heroes fly. What, you need your fake family to stand up for you? Hey. Man, sorry about that. Go, go, go! Get out the way! It is really interesting to see where... Billy Bats. I choose you as champion. Who's gonna play the wizard, Sam? I'm not sure if they cast that. Hello? What? Say my name so my powers may flow through you. But I don't know your name, sir. Shazam. Wait, for real? Say, okay! Shazam? Oh, we look so good. Ah, ah. This means Billy! What is happening? You're the only person I know that knows anything about this Cape Crusader stuff. Can I? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, right? What are your superpowers? Superpowers, dude, I don't even know how to pee in this thing. AM to the BM, BM to the AM. You have super strength. BM, you just got Can you fly? If I quit your BM, I still rock my safe home. If I quit this season, I still be the greatest. You okay? Why are you talking? BM, sit down. You know, I don't think that's gonna buff out. Your phone's charged, your phone's charged. The hell? You're like a bad guy, right? You have bullet immunity! I'm bulletproof. <laughs> you're dead. Sorry about your window! But you're welcome for not getting robbed! Oh hey, what's up? I'm a superhero. Yeah. That is pretty cool. Um, that looks pretty interesting. I mean, it, it definitely is surprising with this trailer. I mean, of course, it's going to be more of a kids movie. I mean, like, like and they did see a lot of inter interviews between the two of them, uh, seeing that it is, you know, uh, it, it is more of a like a family-ish superhero style movie. So I think that's really going to be cool to see um, where things go with this. It doesn't give too much of a story away. It just kind of teases the idea of Shazam and stuff. So if you know Shazam, then you know this, and it's kind of like, there you go already. But uh um, it's going to be cool to see where, where things go with this, and I'm hoping that maybe, you know, I think there's rumors that Superman uh, might appear in there, um, and whether or not he might uh, pop up. I could see him doing that, maybe, you know, Billy's on, uh, if this is in, still in this DC uh, Cinematic Universe, um, Superman might show up, say, seeing that he's doing stuff, and he's doing it a little bit too, too much destructiveness, uh, although that would be quite ironic, as if, Billy's doing, he's doing this stuff, he's, he's trying to stop, stop bad guys, but he's doing it totally terribly, kind of like uh, Hancock in, his, in the movie, where he would just kind of destroy everything, and he would go stop a car chase, and the whole freeway would get destroyed through it, and, you know, Superman maybe shows up to tell him, hey, you need to do it more carefully, you need to watch out on uh, property damage and destruction, and minimize uh, the, the destruction as you're going through and doing this, instead of doing it all um, uh, clumsy the way he's going to do it, but yet... Man of Steel, look at Man of Steel, and he kind of almost destroyed the whole Metropolis. So I think it's going to be cool to see where they they play with that. You know, maybe having Batman in here instead of Superman for something like that could be something that's interesting because I feel like uh, Batman would be the one to, um, who would have heard of that right away, who would have heard of it mo before Superman would, would find out about um, Shazam and stuff, but yet uh, uh, Clark Kent being, you know, a uh, daily uh, reporter and stuff, he would also hear about it through the reporting and also his uh, super hearing would probably hear it through, uh, 
you know, just here at first too. So I think it could be cool to having uh, one of those two cameoing in the movie. Could be quite interesting just to kind of uh, bring his, his spirits up. It's often that they could be quite interesting to see that. Um, and also if, if he sees Superman on, on TV, would he not just be like, hey, I'm going to go help fu Superman and just take off and fly off after him. So I think that's really going to be cool to see that and to see where things are going to go with this. And um, it looks kind of fun. I wish they could tease a little bit more of the, the story as to what he has to do with this because this just looks like, oh, a superhero with this and he's, he's just stopping regular armed robberies at Shazam and that's really not that interesting because he doesn't like who's going to be his challenge where's his challenge that's going to make him have to push himself to really kind of learn it so that's really going to be cool to see that and probably see that in another trailer probably trailer two or more in trailer three when you really get a full sense of the story and what's going to go on with that more than just the basic premise you know this just gives us the 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 summary of the, the movie a little bit like a small thing what doesn't even give us to what the threat is we get a tease as to what it is um with the with that guy with the eye there from the, the comics and stuff I forget his name but uh will be really cool to see where things go with this well, well i kind of like the way this, this this is going i'm not super excited dying to see this not just yet based on this trailer um i am really excited to see the movie but uh this has not really gotten me super as hyped as I'd liked it to have been for the trailer. Um, it just looks, yeah, it's a trailer. But I need to see a lot more before I can make an opinion on how excited I am on it. So right now I'm kind of just, meh, yeah, I'll see this. Uh, and I need to be a little bit more, yes, I need to see this before um, I'm really excited. So we'll have to wait and see. But I'll be seeing any of these movies anyways just because it's, uh, it's DC. So I'll probably even be seeing The Dark Knight when it gets re-released in theaters soon. So you know i'll see them at all just because of the dc logo so yeah let me know what you think guys about this in the comments below what you think about this trailer um you excited for this movie does this get you excited does this kind of bum you out let me know why in the comments and uh i'll see you guys in the next video shazam i'm captain america here to talk to you about one of the most valuable traits a soldier or student can have subscribing sometimes subscribing is the key to victory sometimes it leads to very little and it seems like it's not worth it and you wonder why you waited so long for something so disappointing how many more of these you're still here don't forget to like comment and subscribe guys peace it's over